Hello everyone, I am Trekkie1701C, and let's go ahead and continue our playthrough of FS Port. Uh, last time we had a raider steal a whole bunch of prototype weapons, and uh, I think we're going to be going after the guy who stole them. Uh, he's decided to uh, join up with the Pseudans for some reason. So, agents under Terran control uh, have leaked apparently there's some facilities that also work with uh, humanity, so I uh, don't know why they would do that, but uh, we'll see exactly how this plays out. This operation has been carried out by the numbers. It's always by the numbers. The are not to be tolerated. McCarthy will serve as an example when he is brought in. I guess we're going to execute him or something. Ooh, finally a new fight. Galatea has received a full complement of the new Valkyrie Interceptor fighters. Looks like ugly as shit. Angel Scout fighter. It has been completely modified and fitted with two additional engines, including the fastest fighter in the fleet. It has been redesignated the Valkyrie. Should be able to it's a scout fighter, fighter, but, uh... Report permission for they're still saying it should be good enough. I think it is, but I don't know why it would be designated a scout fighter. Plans for the Avenger weapon prototype have been stolen by Lieutenant McCarthy. His transport has been located here in Antares. It has been designated Omega. Looks like we're going to be going up against some Apollos. One of McCarthy's accomplices has been captured and has revealed his intentions with the stolen plans. Not surprisingly, McCarthy intends to sell the Avenger to the Vasudans. His Vasudan contact Profit here. That's That's always a great here. thing to have. Calling it the calling First the other transport here, the Rasputin, for some reason. I'm not sure entirely what Rasputin has to do with any of this. Uh, as I recall, he just was famous for getting into the Russia's royal family and being really, really, really hard to kill, apparently. Uh, if you don't know what happened with him, I'd look him up on Wikipedia. Apparently, he's like just. He just did not die easily when a bunch of people decided to kill him. Like they threw him in a river and stabbed him and drugged him and everything, and he didn't die. They expect to encounter significant resistance. Beta Wing will focus on attack the Vasudan forces. They're saying significant resistance, so uh, I guess maybe the graph on here is correct, and we'll have a whole eight fighters to contend with. After McCarthy's transport is disabled, the GTT Comet will jump into the area and dock with Where do they come up with the names for this stuff? Because this is... Especially during the docking operation... I mean, I know this is some of Volition's early work, but just some of these names are just, After uh... After the Comet and the Omega have left the area, it is your responsibility bad. to eliminate any remaining hostiles. So, I mean, who calls the, the transport the Comet? You are to jump back to the Galatea. In fact, the only aircraft I can think of called the Comet you know, wasn't that be famous for, like, blowing up. Pilots. These pilots like are traitors to the alliance. Randomly exploding in air. Thousands of lives are at stake. Do not hesitate to use deadly force on the traitors. They are your Don't enemies. hesitate to use deadly force. I thought that's what they were sending us in for, anyways. I don't know why they have to reiterate that. If you resistance or experience severe losses, Delta Wing will be sent by Terran Command to assist. Okay. Further assistance is needed. So I've got uh, as well. two Good extra luck. wings of fighters that could come in. And uh, I have actually lowered the difficulty level on this, uh, not so much because I died last time, but I was spending way too long uh, focusing on blowing things up and not talking, so hopefully this fixes that. Alright, looks like we've got a uh, disrupting weapon and a uh, hole damage weapon. Uh, I guess we'll need the disrupting weapon for the fight, uh, like to take down engines without destroying the ship. Debating whether I should swap out the Apollos with more Valkyries. Let's see what the. Let's see, it's got uh, fair maneuverability, four gun mounts versus four gun mounts, one missile bank, light armor on the Valkyrie, and medium armor on the Apollo. I think I'll just leave the Apollos there for right now. It shouldn't really Alpha matter here. Beta wing ready. Come on, Alpha 2, why are you going and answering things for me? I'm. McCarthy, you are ordered to power down. I answer to a higher authority. So you answer to God? Fire at will, pilot. Don't you understand what happened at Ross 128? Nothing happened at Ross 128. The government told us that. And I trust my government. Take this guy down. 
Well, if you'll die, you can't really see anything with the sun there. Uh, that is something that's new with uh, the source code project engine, is that you will actually be blinded if you're flying towards the sun, at least. Uh, I don't remember seeing that in retail Free Space 2. There goes that guy. Good kill. Let's go ahead and call in a support ship just in case. I mean, I'm not using a lot of missiles now, but uh, you never know. Because, I mean, I, I don't remember any surprises with this mission, but I don't remember a whole lot about it either. And uh, I played, uh, played Free Space 2 a lot more than I've played this campaign, and they were big on just throwing a monkey wrench in things during missions. There he goes. Uh, I guess I should switch to just the disruptor and select his engines. Uh... Roger, disabling your target. Oh, I need to actually divert power to my weapons. Just keep hitting him with the disruptors until his engines go down. Actually, him, I'm gonna take his engines out really quick because he's... I think Carthy's making a break for it, so let's take him down. That's a creative name. Like I said, they weren't really great at names. We have docked with Omega. Oh, and now the Omega is all of a sudden friendly. Uh, I guess because they docked with it, even though they haven't actually boarded it. Uh, that's one other thing they kind of fixed with Free Space Two is they didn't uh, just have the random changeovers like that. They actually, you know. They boarded a ship, they actually put on some theatrics. Rasputin has been captured. Oh, good. Like how the Rasputin doesn't turn friendly. The Omega has been captured. So, uh, do we go back to base, or...? I guess so. Well... That was a four-minute mission, that was short. Didn't really get to try out the Valkyrie that much. Hey, accommodation medal. Recover the Avenger prototype. Good job. Every time Probably I crash into something, I get a medal. I should crash soon. into things more, I guess. Intelligence has told us that you were cautious and managed to disable the Rasputin. Keep Cautious. I told everybody to shoot at him. To assist our cause. This was an intelligent decision on your part, and you are to be commended for your attention. To so blowing it up would have like awarded a commendation medal for your part. Blowing it up would have been retarded. Like it's it's not intelligent to not do something that's retarded. But uh, like I said, the writing for this wasn't that great. Uh, anyways. Uh, I'll go ahead and do a separate video for the next mission. So this is Trekkie1701C signing off. And uh, please remember to like and subscribe if you like this video. Uh, if not, leave me a comment telling me what I could work on. Uh, I'm very interested to hear what I can do better with these.